Hello everyone, Ori here and welcome back to another FIFA 19 Ultimate Team video and today I will make a review on the most OP formation in my opinion in this FIFA 19 being the 4-3-3, the fourth variation and uh, before continuing please make sure to subscribe and leave a like to this video it will really help me to grow my channel uh, so let's go uh, I think uh, this formation is uh, the most OP uh, because this formation uh, allow you to make great counter attacks and uh, just uh, be all over your opponent and uh, try to dominate the game as much as you can uh, now uh, keep in mind that uh, this is a very attacking formation and uh, it's not that easy to use uh, but with the right custom tactics which i'll be showing in a minute uh, we're gonna make this a very balanced formation and uh, you're gonna be able to attack and defend uh, at very high level and uh, not leave a lot of gaps on the defense and uh, try to create uh, those spaces uh, uh, on the attacking side and uh, score uh, a lot of goals and uh, win more games um, uh, so let's go the custom tactics uh, for this 4-3-3 uh, is going to be uh, balanced at uh, with five and deep five at the offensive style we're gonna be balanced too at with five and the player in the box five now this being a, a pit and attack information i like to keep things balanced that's why i've gone with uh, balance at the defense and at the offense too uh, instructions uh, are going to be getting cut cut inside and getting behind for both of your wingers cut inside and getting behind and for your strikers is going to be getting behind and stay forward and for your cam is going to be stay forward now what this does to, to this formation uh, the whole of uh, your upfront trio uh, being your left winger right winger and your striker whenever you have the ball they're just gonna make stupid rounds at uh, the wide of the field and uh, try to to make that quick counter attack uh, and uh, with the cutting side uh, with the cutting side the uh, instruction uh, for example let's say that if your left winger if if your ball is on the left side uh, your left winger has it for example keep in mind that the right winger here is gonna go very near at uh, at the, the the opponent's area almost entering in it and uh, try to to cut that that pass or that cross so it's gonna feel like uh, you have two strikers uh, on your area and uh, it's something amazing the, the the same thing gonna happen even from the the right side when you have the ball on the right side the your left winger is gonna cut inside and uh, try to become that second striker and uh, in, on these situations you're gonna have uh, more players on your opponent's box and uh, that means that uh, you will have more chances to to score more goals so uh, going at your midfielders uh, which for me these two players are going to be the most important players on this team uh, because uh, this formation uh, being a bit uh, uh, the defense and the attack are not going to be so close to to one another uh, these two have to be the links between them and uh, they just have to run back and forth for you uh, so the the two players that have to be here just have to have a good all-around stats uh, on defensive side and uh, on the offensive side too because they will help you create a lot of chances uh, of scoring chances too now going with the instructions that uh, we're gonna go at these players is going to be stay back while attacking and cover center at both of them stay back while attacking 
and cover center. Uh, now going to the defense, uh, you're just gonna put stay back while attacking for both of your full backs. Uh, you cannot leave it at uh, balanced attack or drawing the attack because believe me, they're just gonna make uh, unnecessary run forwards and uh, you will get countered easy. It's very important at this formation that your defensive line uh, keeps on uh, on balance that uh, everybody is on their position and uh, you can defend a bit better uh, and uh, it's not necessary to because uh, with your wingers being that up high on uh, the opponent side of the field uh, it's just not gonna be enough time for them to, to join the attack and uh, it won't be necessary to be honest because uh, these six players up front uh, it will be enough to, to score uh, the whole goals that you need uh, so uh, uh, th this is it the, the custom tactics and the, the players instructions that uh, we, we are going to use uh, for this formation uh, now uh, going to uh, preferred player picks at this formation I'm gonna go just with with two players that for me are a must in this formation and it's going to be Munier and N'Golo Kante. I have them both in my team and uh, for me they are just amazing. I discovered this formation uh, where I had them both. Uh, I like the 4-3-3 because uh, the 4-3-3 uh, fourth variation feels like uh, a 4-2-3-1. Uh, with the camps, but uh, you just don't have the camps at your side. It, it's gonna be wide wingers, and uh, you can create more scoring opportunities. And uh, it's gonna be a lot more fun to play it. And uh, with these two players just being so amazing at the defensive side, and Munier having even some scoring abilities too, he's one of the best all around players in this game. Uh, this formation will become easier and uh, these two guys just uh, if you can afford them they're gonna dominate the midfield I don't think that both of them go for more than uh, 200k 180k something like that but uh, they are just so amazing to have they will never get tired no matter if you play 90 minutes or uh, 120 minutes in this game they will just run back and forth, they will play against icons, I don't know, Ruth Gullit, Patrick Vieira, everyone on this game who is a dominant player, they just don't have problems, they can play against anyone. Now, uh, at the defense, you can go with any player, to be honest, and, uh, and at the goalkeeper too, but uh, at, uh, at your left winger and right winger, I would prefer if you go uh, with uh, very fast players to be honest and uh, with players who have at least those uh, four star skill move just to to try to do that la croqueta is very important when you are on the uh, on the side you just have to abuse that skill uh, this is FIFA this year, there's nothing you can do about it and uh, I would prefer players uh, being a bit uh, tall and uh, big not just uh, small players because they will get pushed away easily and uh, it's not something good with this formation because being that wide on the, on the field uh, your wingers just have to hold their own most of the time and try to create the chances. Now at the striker and at the cam uh, you can go with any player but uh, at the cam position I would prefer something like uh, Neymar if you have the budget or if you don't uh, just go with something like uh, 84 in form Ben Yedder <laughs> is amazing. Uh, depends on the budget that you have if you have a lot of budget then it's something else now uh, with this formation I've made uh, a 50k team the link uh, is gonna be in the description down below it's a hybrid of four different leagues it's amazing and uh, it uh, will help you more uh, try to understand uh, this formation uh, now uh, I will go in uh, some game examples uh, some games that I play uh, 
on the foot champions and uh, if that you can see uh, how this formation mostly works and uh, how do I create my chances and uh, it's gonna be fun so this is my team and uh, I'm gonna try and go into a foot champions match and uh, show you guys uh, mainly how the how the formation works uh, so we see here he's trying to clear the ball with the goalkeeper now Blanc with the header and uh, Munier to Neymar uh, creating uh, that opportunity passing Neymar again to Hernandez with that beautiful turn and Neymar is gonna finish 1-0 uh, for me uh, just a beautiful attack almost everybody getting involved and uh, as you see here He's trying to clear the ball again. Just look at the defense, that high pressure. Uh, they are amazing. Now Baluta to Hernanda is gonna make the turn, and uh, I'm gonna score a lucky goal here. It's gonna go uh, 2 0 for me. Uh, as you saw, the pressure was fantastic. Now going to another opportunity, Kante to Gervinho and uh, Hernandez making that run look at Gervinho he's playing almost as a striker and Baluta too he's cut it inside so much going to look at where Gervinho is and he's gonna finish it just a beautiful that cut inside is gonna make you play almost with three strikers and uh, going to another opportunity I lose the ball and immediately trying to get it back and I'm gonna get it Munier being at the right position going to the Gervinho, beautiful passes, everybody getting involved to Hernandez, to Conte, to Baluta and look at again where Gervinho is and he's gonna bang that too, uh, just an amazing and the opponent is uh, gonna rage quit. So the, there you have it, uh, thank you all for watching, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and uh, leave a like to this video, I will really appreciate it and uh, uh, I see you guys in another FIFA 19 video. Bye.